another delay for people living along 10th Street in Roanoke. The second phase of construction is going a little longer than anticipated, which means the contractor will be losing part of uh, their payment. 10 News reporter Arisha Jones tells us what will happen moving forward. Work between Andrews Road and Williamson Road was supposed to be finished by now. The original completion date was in November and it was pushed back because of the amount of utility uh, work that was on this project. The new final completion date of December 4th came and went. Jason Bond with the Virginia Department of Transportation says weather is to blame for the delay this time. The contractor did not meet the completion date that we had set in early December and because of that we have been, uh, we plan to reduce payment to the contractor going forward. And that is $2,500 a day for Fielder's Choice Enterprises located near Charlottesville. The contractor hired by VDOT. Now, the weather permitting, we're still optimistic that the contractor can get the final paving done on that project and we can get the road open to through traffic uh, restored uh, this month. When 10 News visited 10th Street in October, paving work for that stretch of road just started. But there's been some major improvements since then. So uh, people on 10th Street were no longer driving on gravel sections of roads. VDOT is appreciative for the patience of residents in this Northwest community. I assure you we are working with the contractor and trying to wrap this project up as quickly as we can. In Rono, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you. For the record, we have reached out to Fielder's Choice Enterprises for a comment on the reduced pay, but so far we haven't heard back.